Now let's have another excellent example of air pressure. The hissing you hear in the background is me heat searing some proteins. So here we have an unboiled egg. Here we have a bottle. Now many recipes call for you to separate eggs and in the other video we saw how that how you can separate an egg using just the shell. But what if you want to separate a whole bunch of eggs at once and you don't have a lot of time? Crack all of the eggs together into a bowl. And would you look at that? That turns out to be a boiled egg. Huh. Maybe the spin test isn't 100%. Okay. Be right back with a raw egg. Here we have a non boiled egg. As you can see, non boiled. Now, we want to separate that yolk from the albumin or the white of the egg. How are we going to do that? We have your plastic bottle whose mouth is just a little bit larger than the yolk. You give it a squeeze. Now you're going to use the yolk itself to make a seal. Ah, okay, you can see how this is working. Ah! Okay, theoretically, you can suck up the yolk and separate it. Let's try that again. Remember, your experiments don't always work perfectly. More egg. I suppose I'll be having scrambled eggs for breakfast tomorrow. So, bottle, yolk, suck it up, and there we have and there we have successfully separated the yolk. And if you have a couple dozen eggs you need to separate, if you're making meringue, that's a really quick way to do it. But I do not actually need these eggs separated, so I'm gonna dump it back in. And I'm going to have scrambled eggs with my stir fry. I'm going to alter the experiment a little bit to see if it works. We've got a brand new egg. Now we're going to try this with the large mouth one more time. And it just won't stay up in the bottle. So, remember we use clean bottles for this. I've got a much smaller mouth bottle. And there we go. Let the, let the albumin drip out. There's a much thicker, more membranous part of the... Ah! Well, as you saw, that worked quite nicely. But it tore the yolk apart. So let's try this one more time and see what results we can get. 